Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So here is my before the pen spread in my mini happy planner dashboard layout. So this is my new mini happy planner. It is the, let's flip over into the cover. I think it's a biz babe one and it's the dashboard layout. All right, so I'm gonna show you how I set this up and use this throughout the week. So to set this up, the first thing I do is actually just go ahead and write in my shifts for the week. And I love that the days of the week are already in here, so I don't have to worry about writing those in. And because this is one of the busiest times that we've got in uh, Weight Watchers, I am working basically every day. I've taken a few extra shifts so that I can just help out with the call volume. And that's absolutely fine. I don't mind doing that at all. Because, you know, any extra money from overtime, I can add to my savings for uh, any big vacations we've got coming. So then Monday, I normally write down my chores in here. So what I needed to, what I need to do on Monday is the bathrooms. Now I feel like this week is going to be a little bit crazy because my work shift is different on the Tuesday. I'm going to try and write, I'm going to put down that I do need to do the cabinets and appliances, but I don't know if I'll get the chance to actually do them. And I don't think I'll be able to get around to dusting, but I'm gonna write it in there anyway. And then I'll meal plan and order groceries. And then to, uh, what is it that I, you know what, I feel like I need to, <laughs> then, oh, what else do I need to do here? I feel like I'm gonna wipe that out because I don't know if I'm gonna get any of that stuff done and I feel like there's gonna be way more things that I'm gonna need to worry about on that day. Oh, sometimes wiping it out is just not gonna work out the way I want it to. I don't know, this whiteout that I'm using currently, like all the other whiteouts normally work really well. I'm taking this out. They normally work really well, but, oh, it's because I've run out. Hold on. So when you run out of whiteout like I just did there, then I'm gonna go into the actual sticker book and see if I can find something to cover that up. Now, I know this is right next to the New Year's box, but, Let's just put that like this so I can cover up what's there and then I can write down what I need to. So I will try and get cabinets and appliances done and I will try and dust. I will meal plan and order groceries. That one has to be done. I do need to get to Michael's that day for more yarn. I'm making my friend something for her little baby. And then two things I do also need to do that day. Visit baby Clara. And my family is coming over for New Year's Eve. Then Wednesday, uh, we have my family brunch at IHOP. Then we need to do the baseboards, put away tree. And I need 
to do workshop prep. Then zoom, zoom, move this up here. I will then have coffee with Kim and Mavis. And today I'm gonna do the 12 o'clock grocery pickup. Then Friday I have my WW workshop, trying to get right back into routine with weighing in. Then I'm not sure what the rest of the plans are yet for that day, but that's okay. Saturday, um, no major plans as of yet, but I know that I do have to work. I'm not sure what Rob and the kids are gonna do that day, but we're going to visit baby Clara again now that they're home. And then Sunday, I don't actually know what the plans are yet for Sunday, but it's the usual vacuum and windows. All right, so that is my week set up. I'm gonna put it back in my planner. Oh, and the other thing I keep forgetting to set up, switch to the other side. So down here is where I organize my workout. So the way that I do it is I will write, just write the days of the week. And then as I finish my workouts, I will write it underneath. Perfect. All right, so that is my week set up. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is now Monday. Back into a bit of a routine. I did do the bathrooms and then I had to work today. So that really was the main thing that I did today in terms of chores. I just didn't have enough time with work and things like that. Um, but that was the main thing that I did today. And then I did do a 30 minute full body workout plus 30 minutes of cardio. I really like being able to see it down here. I used to do it in a chart in the notes section, but I feel like it's more motivating seeing it in this space. And I wasn't using this space for anything else anyway, so it was nice to have that. All right, I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is now Wednesday. I'm sorry I didn't get to do um, anything actually yesterday just because it's been crazy, crazy, crazy. I did not do any of the cabinets and appliances or dusting because it was just a crazy day. I did do the meal plan and ordering. I did go to Michael's and I did visit baby Clara. Um, my friend just had her baby and visited her in the hospital. So, so cute. And my family did come over last night. It was kind of impromptu. Um, at first we thought the plans were canceled and then we didn't have anything on. And then that morning my husband was like, oh, now people are coming over. So it was just all over the place. But my family came over last night and didn't even have any food for them. We basically ordered in some pizza. My parents brought in some takeout and then we just played boggle <laughs> and some foosball. It was actually really, really fun. Today um, we went to brunch at IHOP. My family and I like to get together and eat a lot. Then my husband did the baseboards, which was awesome because I had to work today, so I couldn't get to it. He put away all the Christmas decorations and the tree, and I did my workshop prep. Um, and then for my workout yesterday, I did 45 minutes of cardio. I tried to get that in because my shift started earlier yesterday, so my shift started at 7.30, so I got up a little earlier to do some cardio. Just, just to be able to do any type of workout is beneficial. And then um, this morning, I got up a little earlier before everybody else, and then I did a 40-minute upper body and cardio. And then I did another 30 minutes of cardio after that. Just so I can get all those steps in. All right, but that is it for today. Oh, no, that is not it for today. I'm going to write down my meal planning in here, so I'm going to zoom in.
So in this space, I will be using it for meal planning. The main things that I really use this part of the dashboard layout for are for meal planning and for exercise. I don't really use it for appointments or anything. So I like being able to have that extra decorative space here. So let's see here for Friday. That will be Turkish pita pizza. And if you guys don't know this already, I pick up my groceries on Thursday, so I start my meal planning from Friday, Friday to the following Thursday. So this will be for this coming Friday. And Saturday, what are we doing? Ah. Saturday will be a slow cooker burrito bowl. Sunday is going to be either a movie night or pizza. Then Monday will be the, uh, the burrito bowl, leftover burrito bowl. It's actually a really easy recipe. I might do a plan with me on that one. Tuesday is potato cheese soup. My writing is really messy when I'm writing on the discs. I really should have taken this out. Uh, Wednesday is chicken parmesan casserole. This is going to be chicken parm cass. <laughs> then Thursday will be leftover chicken parm casserole. Now for my lunch, did I decide on what my lunch is? I don't think I did. I did not. I had like two days there that we might have leftovers, but lunch has not yet been decided, so that may come next week. We'll see. All right, so that is the meal planning for next week. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it's now Friday. Sorry for missing yesterday, but just going in here and checking off a few things. I had coffee with Mavis, but not him, unfortunately. And then I did do my grocery pickup. And then for uh, workouts, I did do a, uh, I think it was 45 minute cardio. And then today I also did a 45 minute cardio. I need to do, I need to get to doing more um, weight training. I really need to get on that. So today, Friday, we went to my WW workshop. I was down. I lost 1.1 pounds of the 2.7 pounds I gained over Christmas. So back on track to get rid of that. And then I went to, went to Bountiful Market with the kids. I love going to Bountiful Market. Then I had to work this afternoon. So it was really just a quiet day. All right, so I will see you guys, if not tomorrow, definitely Sunday. Hey guys, so it is now Sunday. I We didn't really do much yesterday. Um, it was just kind of a relaxing day around the house, so we did not go see baby Clara yesterday. I want to kind of, I want to put a sticker over that, actually. Let me see if I can find my seasonal stickers. I want to put a sticker over that rather than just cross it out. So let's go in here to the seasonal book and see if there's a small sticker I can find to go over that. Um, doesn't look like it. So actually, what I might do is just put this over like this. You can still kind of see it, so I might just wipe this out so that you can't see it from underneath the sticker. And then we'll just write that last night we had a movie night. And uh, we take turns choosing and my daughter chose to watch Nine Lives with uh, Kevin Spacey and, um, oh my gosh, what is her name? But Kevin Spacey's in it, I cannot remember the actress. Jennifer Garner. And it was actually a surprising movie. I mean, it's not gonna win Academy Awards, but it's a fun one to watch with the family. And then today, my husband did do the vacuuming and the windows. And then today I am gonna go visit 
baby Clara. So let's see if I can find something that I can put down. Hmm. Maybe a, maybe just a little get it done. Is it Clara? Perfect. That is it for the week, actually. I mean, because it's the week before the kids go back to school and it's a little bit of a vacation week, it it's been kind of all over the place, but I will be really happy to get back onto a routine tomorrow. All right, I uh, hope you guys had a great week. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day.